Camp Joyelle retreats allow amazing experiences for families, especially father and sons. Does God speak more at camp? Perhaps, but we do know there is a lot less distraction. Today we are going to be here at the Father Son Retreat here for 2022. So before we get into this video, give us a big thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, hit that notification bell for another good video like this one. Here, Friday night, we stand in line, waiting anxiously to get checked in so we can head off to the cabin. What are you guys doing in here? Why, is one too hard or one too soft? Joy L is a place where I have been able to get away from the hustle and bustle of life and into a renewed relationship with our creator and closer to my son. The next day we got up early and made sure we ventured around to see what all there was throughout the camp. Started back in 1974 with a focus to provide opportunities to experience life change. We then entered into the worship area where we got up and we started singing and dancing and did multiple different songs. Then when the speaker got up, he gave us a nice message about what all we're going to be learning and started talking about the full armor of God. Our sons are going to learn from us. And men, there is no better teacher of your sons than you. Then as we were leaving, then we got our Saturday devotions and we headed out and we went back to the cabin and started reading over it, checking the Bible and looking at the verses that we were reading and went over the questions. He answered, I heard you in the garden and I was afraid because I was naked so I hid. And he then we headed off to the gym and we were playing soccer and basketball and football and all the other sports. Are you excited about being here? Yeah. Is this your first time mm -hmm. at uh, Father Son? Yes. What are you expecting to see this weekend? Doing the zipline and the go karts and all that stuff. So then we played dodgeball, and it was so much fun because it was kids versus adults. So we were running up to grab all the dodgeballs. Oh, what we've all been waiting for. Time to eat. Oh, then afterwards, we headed off to the camp store. All right, hey guys, I'm Rachel. We have our camp store here. We have a few new sweatshirts, um, some different goodies, a lot of different animals, things like that. So if you guys want to stop by this weekend here at Joyelle, we have a bunch of stuff you can buy. Hey guys, welcome. Now we have the peanut butter cup pit. It's the most funnest thing because you get to go on this rope and swing over the mud pit, a mud pit, which we call the peanut butter pit. Having fun? Oh yeah, you know, it's Saturday. Another week, weekend. And it's hard to believe it's lunchtime already. Are you excited about being here? Yeah. Come on. Say We're something dry, fun. I'm gonna try great. Now there's Gaga Ball. We're all gonna try and beat each other at a game of Gaga Ball. Oh, that's <laughs> there's human foosball. 
Now, we're getting ready for the rock one, climbing wall. Whenever you climb up, you get to climb up the 35 foot climbing wall and then descend down. Well, what do you think, buddy? It was fun. It wasn't like it was hard at some points, but then easy at others. Like it was really easy starting, but then it got harder. Now, time for the zip line, the best part of my weekend. Because who will hit the bottom first? Now comes Ben and Bo. Okay, boys, what did you guys think of that? It was fun. It was really fun. It was very fast. Was it worth the wait? Yes. Most kids enjoy the air rifle. Can I hit the bullseye? One. When you get up on the third, see that orange cone up there? I want to know. Levi, tell me what you're getting ready to do. So I'm getting ready to drive the go karts because, well, it just seems like a fun thing to do. Okay, so I'm about to go here next whenever the next go kart comes around, uh, whenever they finish with their third lap. Well, what do you think? It was really fun. Any more carnage okay. this morning? Guys, have a good time? Yeah. What about Frisbee golf? What? Look at that around. Let's make those chains rattle. That was my part. Did you guys enjoy yourself at Camp Joyo? Yeah, we did. So what's the best part you guys enjoyed? Speaker. The speaker? Probably all the activities. Yep. The food. All that. Yeah, the food's pretty good. time for quiet time spend it with our son going through the devotions and answering the questions <laughs> and then comes some more free time Sunday morning comes capture the flag. Who's going to bring that flag across the line? All right, so what's the check to capture the flag? You're going to find and return the opposing team's flag, carry it across the borderline, which is marked with cones out here. Now, some of them might have gone. Tell me about it. So, this older gentleman, like this guy over here, he ran, we all ran over. He grabbed it, and then he got tagged out, so then someone threw it over to and he threw it over to this one kid, and then the flag came off, so I picked it up and ripped it, and then ran. And then both came so who come across the line with the flag? It was me and this other kid. He had the pole and I had the flag. Because it was ripped apart. <laughs> So Levi. Yeah. 
But what do you have to say about the weekend? What did you enjoy the most? Well, I enjoyed the cup shop flag because that was fun. I enjoyed the go carts and stuff. Fathers, there's no better teacher than you. So spend some time with your son at the Father Son Weekend at Joyelle. That happens the second weekend in November of every year. So look at the description below for the link to Joy L Camps.